So this question is a diagram question because it provides some visual input for us. We have this number line here, or at least this line that has points. We have P, Q, R, S, and then we have these, uh, these expressions here that I'm assuming that represent the distance between our letters. So the question says on PS above PQ equals RS. Okay, well, if we know that PQ is X minus one, so if PQ equals R S, but we know that PQ is X minus one, and we know that R S is three X minus seven, then we can actually figure out what X is, right? So I am going to subtract three X from both sides, just so that I have X's on the left hand side. You could have definitely uh, consolidated your X's on the right hand side, but X minus three X is negative two X. I still bring down this minus one equals, this is now gone and equals negative seven, right? And I'm gonna add one to both sides to consolidate my numbers on the right hand side. So the one is gone here. I still have negative two X, negative seven plus one is negative six. Divide both sides by negative two. And what I'm left with is that X is equal to positive three. But what's the question asking? What is the length of PS? Well, PS, right, is the entire length. PS is equal to X minus one plus X, right? X minus one plus X plus three X minus seven. So all together, that's X plus X plus three X. That's all together. I have five X and then negative one and negative seven. So that's minus eight. So five X minus eight. But I know, right, I'm finding this when X equals three, because I already know that X is equal to three from the very first statement that the question gave me. So now I'm just going to substitute X with three. So I have five times three minus eight, which is 15 minus eight, which is equal to seven. So therefore my final answer here is seven.